All right, guys, in this video, we are going to display the source polylines and change the surface style. Now, note this exercise uses the drawing you created in the previous exercises. Or you can open the surface 1B drawing by clicking open, drawing, click on your Civil 3D training shortcut. Civil Tutorials, Drawings, and scroll down till you get to Surface 1B. Now click on the Home tab, go to your Layers panel, click on the drop down, and navigate to the underscore EG underscore breaklines layer, which can be found up here. Let's go ahead and thaw that layer. click on it and you can see how our polyline showed up right here now the 3d polylines let's go ahead and select them these 3d polylines represent the edge of pavement of an existing road that are displayed on the east side of the site Note that the edge of pavement polylines were included in the drawing template you used in exercise one, creating a tin surface. Let's go ahead and exit out of this, deselect our polylines. Now select the surface and then right click. Click surface properties. And now in the surface properties dialog box, we wanna look at the information tab and under surface styles we want to click on contours and triangles because we want to see our tin lines now click OK there's a lot going on there isn't there now the surface now shows contours and triangles that illustrate the existing surface triangulation now let's create break lines from the 3D polylines in the tool space under our prospector tab which we're already in I want you to go under surfaces click that little plus icon and you see right now for our existing surface we have this little uh, circle with a slash through it right now it says that this surface is locked in the drawing let's right click our surface and click unlock next go to the plus icon and click our definitions and right here we have a definition for break lines go ahead and right click on that click add and then we get our add break lines dialog box here under description type in edge of pavement dash existing road and then we're going to use the default values for the rest of this stuff right here. Next, go ahead and click OK. Now you see how right now, next to our cursor and in our command line, it says select objects. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's select our edge of pavement and hit Enter. Now the surface triangulation is now modified, as you can see. The edge of pavement and break lines are applied and the tin surface is adjusted along the break line edge. So we just modified the surface triangulation. So that's how you add break lines to a surface in Civil 3D 2020.